Hello, Improv Tipsters. Welcome back to Improv Tips, where I and some of the best improvisers in the world give you improv tips and advice to make you a better, more confident, and happier improviser wherever you are in your improv journey. I am, as always, your host, Paul Valencourt. Let's begin. Today's guest improv tipper is Rich Tellerico. Now, if you're going to make a list of people that have taken the comedy journey and hit all the highlights along the way, Rich Tellerico would have to be on that list. Rich is a Peabody Award winner, a four-time Emmy nominee, writer, director, actor, producer. He's worked on Key and Peele and Mad TV and SNL, and that's just to name a few. Ding, ding, the whole story down below. It is worth a read. It is a who's who and a what's what of comedy, and Rich brings so much to the table. If you're into improv, you may know him from his legendary trio, Dasarisky, which is him, Rich Tellerico, Bob Dassey, and this guy, ding ding, newcomer, Craig Gakowski. I don't know if you've heard of him. He's an uppercomer. He's, he's pretty good. So um, it is a fantastic trio. They are a powerhouse of improv. And if you ever get a chance to see them here in LA or at a festival somewhere, I highly recommend that you do it. You will not be sorry. Also, in today's tip, Rich is talking about transcribing your sets, transcribing your improv sets. This is a technique that honestly, I've never heard of and I have never done. And every time I think, I'm doing these tips for years and years, every time I think, you know what? I've heard it all. Then someone comes with something, I'm like, oh my gosh, I've never heard of that. I've never done it, but I can tell you this much, if it is so, one of the things that makes Dash Risky so flipping good, you can bet that I'm gonna try it out. Also, it's sort of nestled in, the, the, the middle of this tip is a little technique called I Know, which I really love. It's a technique that I learned from Craig Gakowski and that I use all the time and I recommend to students all the time. So listen for that as well. It's like a little Easter egg in there. Make sure you, that you attend to that as it comes up. I should also say that there's a really fantastic opportunity coming up. I'm posting this tip on Monday, and this coming up Sunday, June 6th, June 6th, uh, Dasarisky is teaching a class about this technique of transcribing your improv sets, how to get the most out of it, how to use it to make your, your improv and your comedy better and better and better. Again, I highly recommend it. All the guys bring such experience to the table. Uh, I don't think you can go wrong. All that information, ding, ding, how to sign up and everything, down below. I would recommend jumping on it because it's a limited amount of people and these guys are fantastic and a big draw and uh, I can only imagine it's going to sell out pretty quick. So please check that out. Before we get to Rich's tip, thanks for watching Improv Tips. Um, please uh, like and comment down below. Are you going to try to transcribe your sets? Have you done this before? How has it worked out for you? I'm curious to know uh, if I'm the only one who's <laughs> missing the boat on this fantastic technique. Also, consider subscribing so you get the Improv Tips as they come out for great guest tippers like Rich Tellerico and Craig Kikowski, and also tips from me sometimes. Um, that's not so bad. So, uh, I think that's about it. That's all the announcements. Let's get down to it. Without any further ado, please sit back. Relax and enjoy. Rich Tellerico. Hello, Rich Tellerico here, and I'm very happy to present this improv tip, transcribe your shows. Since the late 1900s, I have been lucky enough to perform with Bob Dassey and Craig Kikowski on a three-person improv team called Dasariski. Like many improv groups, we videotaped our performances not only for posterity, but also as a tool so we could rewatch the shows and learn from our mistakes. Then one day, some years back, as part of a writing process, we began to transcribe our taped shows. Transcribing improvisation forces you to relive and re-examine every moment-to-moment -moment choice, line by line, word by word. And we discovered that transcribing was a great teacher that offered insights that might not have come if we had just watched the show tapes. For example, we discovered one phrase that kept popping up in the better shows was, I know. The scenes and shows were better when the characters already knew what was going on in their worlds. The I know laden shows were more focused with less meandering. The details, specifics, and relationships flowed. Because of this, we developed a mantra for ourselves as improvisers, one that we all teach to this day. Choose to know. Watching our tapes, but also transcribing our shows had helped us discover a mindset that improved the quality of our work. And ever since then, we have each incorporated an I know type exercise into our teaching. And as always, we encourage all students of this work to transcribe your shows.
Hey friends, thanks for checking out the video, and uh, if you want to hear a little bit more, check out one of these two quality videos. And if you haven't done so already, please subscribe and follow us on social media. All the links are in the description down below, and let me know what you would like to see an improv tip about. Thanks for watching.